out after a while. You zone out, you know. Do it somehow. It's zony work. It's like taking drugs, you know. Just better. When you're in a new environment, I think that you're hearing at a higher level, you're seeing at a greater level, you're not just surrounded by cliché or generic or whatever the word is, sounds and scenes that you've seen before. And I guess that's what, again, you're leading to this freedom thing in the music. You're in another place. Oh, wow, listen to this. You know, this is happening. Oh, wow, this is special. And, and that gives you that. We are cre trying to create that space within the music that you've, you have experienced when you're traveling and when something is new. You know, it's actually easier to feel that way when you're in a totally new environment. I was away a year, touring around Europe, and I thought to myself, that's funny, you don't ever think about Melbourne at all. Why don't you think, the only thought I had was, why don't you think about it? And it takes me about six weeks to get used to any one place, and then I live there. And what, what does this place have? It's a great place to create things. It's not easy to sell them here. It's not easy to find an audience here. But the people you do find are really beautiful. You know? and, and I'm happy to play to a few beautiful people. All important stuff, you know. Very important stuff. Doing this, who was sending last year? Somebody, Zina. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you can do it. Yeah. Yeah. It's all cool. Cool. You can celebrate once more. Oh well, the Cory, she will have a good time when she came home. She was saying, "Wow, the Christmas." Doesn't she want to do it herself? Because she loves to do it. Might be a nice idea, isn't she? Yeah, yeah, leave it. Let her do it. Yeah, it's shit done for it. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I found this as well. That's an old car. Cool. Any trouble is you've got to move the car now. Yeah. 
going to go off, I know for a fact. I don't have to worry about a damn thing. I don't have to prepare anything. I don't have to take anything there. It'd be like five people in the spa having a ball, just enjoying it, you know. Have you played with Bob before? Yeah, many, many times. Yeah, many times. And Tez played with him about 400 million times. And uh, Bob always looks like it's the first time he's played. He's been playing with him for about 35 years. Always looks like it's the very first time he's played. He's sort of he's just got a great rapport, you know, just great energy, and uh, yeah, I'm really looking forward to it. <laughs> Thank you. Yo, Ian, it's Peter. Better give you my new number. Hi. <laughs> Where's my hug, Arthur? <laughs> yeah. Well, I don't know how much rehearsal we're going to do uh, as yet because uh, still trying to get onto Bob Sedegrin and um, he did have a gig, then he didn't, and then he did, and then we can't get in touch with him. But somehow you and I and uh, Ted and Mick will get together, even if it's here. Oh, we've got a nice stretch of bush that we can practice in just right next to the place here yeah. and there's a few uh, you know birds you can study magpies and all of that oh, no worries. well get this in okay. I'll be laughing hi big Derek how, how are you Nubo? hey Nuba, pleased to meet you <laughs> there you go very well Tom <laughs> well welcome mate oh look good journey yeah. 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 Um, and when, we, when do we get to play today? Because I didn't play yesterday driving. Yeah, home. this afternoon as soon as we'd like. There's a spot in the bush here that we're going to play right yeah. away. Yeah. And, uh, got a good camping site on the way over. Yeah. Like Ruse and Emus thumping through in the middle of the night. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. 
It's Peter Harper, the Drink. false limbs man. Hey, Dick O, good to see you, Peter. You're welcome back from the old dark. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I haven't seen you since um, Bangalore. No. Well, so what are we going to play then? Uh, Dick O's written a piece. Beauty. When you said everybody's got to pick one what? piece. Beauty. Oh, and you love one. Ascension. One. Oh, you know. And then two <laughs> weeks later, I said to him, You still want to do Ascension? He says, No, I want to do Golden Wedding. <laughs> <laughs> I said, well, I want to do Golden Wedding as well. So one of I didn't say, I didn't say and I was going to play two. I said, I've got a couple. Oh, right, to, to try. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Oh, I'm going to try. So, I don't know, whatever. Is it Golden yeah. Wedding? Yeah. Oh, that's fine. Yeah. That's <laughs> three times. <laughs> what about you? What do you want to do? Golden Shower. Golden Shower. Golden Shower. Out of Gifford 7711. Have you got that line four over here? <laughs> singing a D, uh, uh, E there on your B. Oh, yes, okay. But it's supposed to, I've got something written. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. I prefer the other note that you sang, so it's better. Ted's playing it with us, sort of yeah. light at the time, and then in between the phrases, then he can do all his and fills, and, and this is, I'm commenting on this, yeah. and then we come in with our next little yeah. bit, and he'll know where the head is and where the, the, the spaces yeah. are. Yeah. It's a bit like Happy House rather than, you know. actually improvise and not just create some generic line. As soon as you start thinking about things, you've missed the point. You've got to have faith in the whole process, let go and know that you're well connected and everything you're going to do is connected. Now, I mean, while you're playing a simple line from a simple song that people can get their ears and their teeth into, you're not really actually having an experience and neither is the audience. But for us, that's leading them into this space where we are going to try and get into this magical knowing state. And they will know as well. Hopefully.
Yes, it's the big issue tonight. The big issue, yeah. Love the big issue, folks. Why it's our Christmas edition tonight. Two vendors from Sydney. Louis on Buswick Street, Fitzroy, the number one, baby. I'm the number one and the greatest. Yes, you are. <laughs> <laughs> you're doing it, Louis, too, so I had to do it too. <laughs> and I had to learn another two. But they actually watch, they don't listen, so what it is, if you're playing in a rock band, what it is, if you're playing bass, you don't listen. What you do is, if the, if the guitarist puts his, this should be, this is no sound, <laughs> no sound. <laughs> if, 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 if someone, you don't know who we're talking, if someone puts their fingers on F sharp, then everyone watches what their fingers are. Yeah. So I was a little bit behind, so I'm sorry I'm a little bit behind, boys. I'm actually listening. <laughs> One more minute to go. Just when you could see me having a heart attack.
what I'm asking the audience to do, it's, it's probably a little bit too much, you know. A lot of people just don't want that, you know. It's too confronting, you know, what they're going to see themselves, you know. It's, it's not everybody's cup of tea. And we've been playing a long time, you know, I've been playing with Ted for 24 years and we've been working towards this thing as hard as we possibly can, you know. When we go to the Make It Up Club, we just improvise totally. And even within that improvisation, I'm still trying to keep those people, give them something that sounds, you know, a bit generic in a way, or melodic. And, and, I, and I think that's, you know, it's just language and it's, we want to be melodic. It wants to be, I want it to be beautiful, you know. I just don't want to go through that process of having it all pre-worked out. I want it to sound like it's worked out, but it's not. It's just actually happening and it's very, very real at that moment and it's 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 something that's very fragile, you know, and I want to guard it and I want to bring it bring it out as much as I possibly can, you know. It's it's very fragile. That confidence in one another is that same thing you know we were just talking about uh, before of when you're going oh well it's not that now it's my solo I got to play it's like I got nothing I got nothing to say or I, I can't nothing's speaking to me in, from inside me the ensemble's cruising away I, I don't have to play now and that thing of I want to play I want to play but I'm going to break it and then you reach that point well I've got to play I've got to play and it's that same thing of uh, same thing. Uh, confidence in the ensemble of knowing that even if I even if I do do this and I do break it we like doing this thing and we like one another so much we like we like what happens in this situation that people that the ensemble is then going to go in and someone's going to go yeah yeah break it you know like oh now it's gone there now we'll go there now we'll make that not not no, fuck <laughs> you know what I mean like that's that's yeah. never the that's never the response yeah. and if you've got people interested in each other's conversation, they'll pick up on it and expand on it. If Ian now brings a new topic, we're going to start talking about that topic, you know, and if I do want to harp back and reiterate what I've said before because I think there's something left to say, then I'll do that too. Mm. And the beauty of us, we can have five conversations at the same time, and at times we can be exploring our own mind, and at times we can be supporting each other. And the thing is, who has the most energy at any one time? That's the person that we will be running with. There's an active listening, talking, talking and listening at the same time. You know, if you're not doing both, nothing will happen. You know, if you haven't got anything to say, uh, you won't be able to support and you won't be able to say anything new. So you find all of those people can do both at the same time. And, and that's the difference. That is really the difference in this kind of music. It's yes. supporting whoever has the passion at the moment because it is passed around you know it doesn't stick with one person and we all do what he says for it because that's boring you know it's just boring it's a very powerful and and, and um, fortunate thing to do I guess improvising and, and you know it's like like I'm improvising now talking to you guys and you're improvising asking me these questions and I so, scripted, yeah <laughs> but like you know it's just I, I sort of see it in in every single walk of life you know like it's just sort of communication and it's just people being you know people being honest and all that sort of stuff and that's what I sort of feel it should be and that's maybe what people get a buzz from listening to it or witnessing it is like you know it's, it's a it's an honest uh, display of someone's character, someone's self-expression, mm. artistic expression, whatever, you know.
Bob and uh, Ted, I haven't played with them, so oh, we had only three times straight, so I don't know what's going on. A bit nervous, eh? A little bit. <laughs> Pretty scary. But uh, yeah, it's good. Sounds good. Uh, not bad. Okay. <laughs> Is there new stuff you come up with? Yeah, one of the songs is new. So, um, yeah. Um, I think I'm going to sing three songs, so one is new and two I've been playing it before, so yeah. it's going to be... Uh, was part of the Go Jam? Too. Yes. Yeah. yeah. It's going to be cool. Hey! I reckon you should have those glasses on while you're singing. Uh, yeah, how's that? A bottle of the mini, a bottle of the mini. <laughs> <laughs>
that day was good. Very dark, yeah. <laughs> And don't try and play in time, just go play right over I just, it. No, I just said to try it in six and see what happens. Oh, yeah, yeah, for sure, but I'm just saying. You yeah, know. of course, you see what happens. Yeah. You're right. Mm. Make it more legato, longer. Yeah, get, get your tone coming out of it, you know. Beautiful. You might not even need the bridge. I don't see you even needing that. I like it just the just the head, you know, just fucking noodle. Don't need that bit, man. Icy. Oh, cold. <laughs> cold. 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 Cold as all fuck. <laughs> cool. Cool. Oh, 
Yeah, I like that. No, it's moving too much. You bought it? Yeah, I bought it. I liked the first one, but they, I had to do it again because it wasn't right for the for the no, film. No, 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 no. The film. <laughs> That's the gay movie. I haven't gay. What are you talking about? Haven't you known all these years? Ten, I'm madly in love with you, you silly old bugger. <laughs> so what's next then? We've got uh, we've got um, Scarborough Fair to do. All right. <laughs> Can we do the icy version of that? Uh, who did all that? Come on! You know how long your mum spent doing this? Oh. That's good. Now make sure everything gets cleared up. Okay. Lid first. Come on. There's the lid. Oh my goodness, what a mess. Put the lid on now! It was just completely improvised. There's one of us a bit earlier at Bennett's Lane. These these three I did last year. Okay, so there's some for you actually. Fantastic. You can have those. feeling at the moment, <coughs> you know, just, oh, you've got to do this, you've got to do that, you've got to do this, you've got to do that, you've got to do this, you've got to do that, you've got to do this, you've got to do that, you've got to do this, you've got to do this, it's going to cost you this, it's going to cost you that, yeah, and then yeah, you can yeah. sell 50 CDs, and you're going to get some poxy gig somewhere, you know, and most people aren't going to, oh, fuck off, mm. you know, what a lot of crap, you know, if the... If in the end the people are into it in the group and you're having a really good time, that's what you're really doing it for. You can't sleep. Yeah. Just try, just turn it over and try. Okay. Okay. Lie down, close your eyes. Next time, when we give you dinner, just finish it, please. Don't give okay. it, don't make another work for us. Be tired. Big flies going in our head. Oh God. Shall we kill him? Give it to the bats farm in you. Okay. We can let it out. But I know. Family. I know what keep going everywhere. Huh. Maybe because it wants to get out. Has it? Maybe. To ask the audience to have an experience of what you're doing, rather than giving them this form, that melody, this, that and the other, is very difficult. Now, it's so difficult, we've been trying to keep an audience by giving them something to bring them in and then well what happens if we just let go of the rails and what happens if you just experience it and some people do and some people just don't you know being free is just not for a lot of people it's very 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 difficult and it's difficult for us it's difficult for all people for me it's difficult to actually be free
I would like to put the saxophone through the PA, if yeah. possible. Yeah. And I might as well do the trumpet as well. That's, that's not a muscle. Yeah, he's here to do, do, do an extra, put an extra mic in, or if, if a lead out from yours into the PA, we can do that for a couple of lines. Yeah, I'll put separate, because obviously yeah. it's better, yeah. it's fine. I can, just, I can just set up a, a 57 on a stand for you to play into. Perfect, thanks, okay, mate. No, perfect. Excellent. But there, if I was a saxophone player, playing trumpet, I'd want, you know, I might have about 3,000 watts. <laughs> so I could back off it if I wanted to, you know what I mean? Yeah. But it's there for me if I want it. Yeah. Yeah, oh, wicked, wicked. Eventually, I was I was then in my own business in advertising. I decided to get out of Brisbane, come back to Melbourne, so I did. And all the band came down as well, and they went and studied at the College of the Arts and got their jazz certificate, which allows them to play jazz now, of course. And uh, we stayed together, and we played just about everywhere all the time. So that, and that band was um, Peter Harper, uh, Ian Chaplin, Tony Pay, a guy named Craig Dickinson, who was a tenor player also from Brisbane, and myself. Did a lot of things, then but we changed it around. We eventually got Sam Fevers in the band as a piano player. Tony stayed there. We got uh, Adrian Sheriff on the trombone. We had um, another tenor player uh, whose name escapes me now, um, Greg, somebody who now lives in Amsterdam. But it's it's always changed. And the beautiful thing about the change in personnel of the band is that the music went in another direction again. So so it never got stale. These guys are prolific writers, though. I mean, Peter is an amazing composer. And, I'm sure if he sat down and got a, a book together, it would be about two yellow pages fat of the compositions in his room. So it's always been interesting in that the, the music was really structured for the personnel of the, of the band at the time. So it, so it was always changing. It's always made it fantastically interesting for me. And, uh, and also, I had the, 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 the beautiful, comfortable position as nobody ever wrote me a chart, right? Nobody ever said, this is the what I wanted to play. I always had full licence to play it the way that I wanted to, which is, suits me fine. Uh, bonjour. <laughs> <laughs> So, does that one have a title at all? No, I don't know. I don't know what it's called. It's just, we don't know what it's called. Yeah. All right then, it's that one then, okay. Sorry? Yeah. 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 It comes from an album called Dope on Plastic, but it lost the tape of it. And so I don't know who wrote the bloody thing. I don't even know what it's called. Can we call it plastic or just give it some key, some key idea? identify where the last phrase is coming and that's yeah. all. Yeah. Uh, I, I know. Yeah. And then the last time, the third time, it just does this. And you hold the E flat diminished for two right and then back to the top. to you. <laughs> I'll listen to you. So if he's going to pull a harmony in a bridge, do you want me to go back to the unison or yeah. how melodic? It sounded really dark for me and I liked it. If you really got to be happy though, because I can do either. You've got to be happy. <laughs> we'll play it in unison then. Yeah? yeah that, that, right. that scale in it. any of those notes, just anything. A, B, four chord, you know that. And then non-Q. 
cue, uh, the second cue, I'd like to play just those five notes of that Amharic scale. Just keep the six going, you know, it can even slow down a bit, I don't care. gentlemen, we're going to start with a piece called Handbrake. You just don't know who's going to lean across and just sort of pull the handbrake on it. Thank you. 
That's very good. So Barney. So Barney. That's very good. And Dixon. Miss Mar to the Harper. Thank you very much. Good night. and remember, no, to, remember no. to pay Ted. Yeah, um, are these organic chicken pellets? Yeah, oh, it's fine. <laughs> Keep me going for ages. <laughs> I'll waste it on alcohol. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Peter. All the best for Christmas and New Year. Right into the night. Okay, see ya. See ya. Thanks for everything. Well, what time we, we said to her we came home? 11.30. 11.30, between 11.30 and no later than 12. It's quarter to 12, so we run out of time. Are you gonna guys watch the soccer? Uh, yeah? Maybe? Uh, I see how it go. I'm pretty perky at the moment. Pretty good, but we've got an early start tomorrow. I'm gonna have a recording. We'll see how it goes. Seems like we're still sleeping, I'm gonna sleep. She's gonna go work six o'clock, so she has to sleep. Can we set a bed up for her somewhere? If you, you two, if you watch, you can sleep in the car and you just sleep as well.
life passes so damn quickly, it's all over. This time will pass so quickly. The life of all of this will be so quickly gone that all I want to do is just make the most of it and pay homage to all the beautiful people, you know, the people around me, particularly the people that I'm playing with. <laughs>